What's going on, Commander? This is the Game Hunted channel with another episode of Star Wars Commander Empire. And in this episode, I have some awesome, awesome news about the game. Let me see. Your squad has increased your reputation level 8. Ba -ba 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 -ba. And we have access to some new perks. Nice. The smuggled munitions and situation normal. I'm going to take a look to those before even moving. I got a couple things to do in here. But you know what? Let me. Let me recollect some of the resources that I have. Real quick. Ba -ba 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 -ba. And then we're going to take a look to the perks in a second. To see which are the new additions that we have ready. I um, need to go here. Hold on. Perks. Okay, so we got three slots perks. So we can probably go for the, the new ones. Are the parts and... Technical group. Mercenary hand cost five hundred decor repair time minus three percent. Okay, I'm gonna do whatever I can to provide some support to my squad. So probably this one, training to cost I don't know. Okay, you know what? Let's go with that one. It is funny that I apparently apparently the leader is the one who needs to pay for everything. <laughs> apparently. So uh, gotta be ready for that here mobilization trims and the regeneration rate okay okay here we go another perk and ah, there you go another perk there you go guys we got three more perks we're gonna start upgrading some more stuff in a few uh got a point of reputation got a point of reputation so maybe it can help with the to take a repair time uh, that's not too bad okay we're gonna invest in this one perfect okay all right, so I have some awesome, awesome news for us. I hope you guys are ready because this episode is going to be special. We're not going to do any attacks. We're not going to review any defense, but I'm going to show you what is coming in Star Wars Commander. Super excited about this. So hope you guys are ready. Let's start checking the new things, the new additions that are coming to the game. Character updates. Because in the future, we're going to see some changes in the graphics of the game. In the left side, for example, this is a proof droid. Left side is the before, right side is the after. And you can see some big changes in the details, textures, lining, and that is so, so, so cool. I love to see every single detail with every single unit and character in Star Wars. In Star Wars in general. So if they bring this also to the game, Oh my, it's gonna be amazing. So you can see this is a quick preview of how the proof draw is gonna look before and after. But there is more. Another example, Han Solo. Look at the big changes from the left side to the right side. In the right side, you can easily, clearly see Harrison for face. It's just so cool. The details, I mean, you can definitely identify a character from the Star Wars right away just looking at it. The one on the left side, okay, it's fine. You can see the outfit. I mean, you understand that it's Han Solo, but in the right side, you can definitely see Harrison Ford. Amazing. Another example, Princess Leia. Left side before, right side, the new and improved Carrie Fisher Leia. Again, you can see clearly on the screen in the right side that it's exactly like Leia from Empire Strikes Back, right? That is so, so, so clear. In the left side, like I mentioned before, the outfit, okay, that helps you to understand which character it is. But in the right side, you can definitely see Carrie Fisher's face in Princess Leia. So, so happy for all these lining, texture, and graphics upgrades in Star Wars Commander. Let's welcome a new building in Star Wars Commander, the Armory. <laughs> because this has been one of the biggest requests of the Star Wars Commander community, and I'm completely proud of those, <laughs> all those fellas that were pushing so hard for this to happen. The Armory. What does the Armory mean? That means that you're going to be able to customize your units depending on which planet you are located. <laughs> That is so cool! Right now on the screen you can see the levels 1 to 6 of the Rebel Armory. There's also, of course, 1 to 6 for the Empire. But again, the most important feature is that with every upgrade, you're going to be able to unlock different uh, skins that you can use for different characters in the games. And don't worry about it. 
I got some previews, you guys are ready? Let's take a look! For example, if your base is located in HOT, look at this! Now, you, instead of using Rebel Soldiers and regular Stormtroopers, now you can start using Echo Base Soldiers and Snow Troopers! <laughs> that is gonna be so epic, fellas! So, so epic! I cannot wait to see these changes! Look at this! It looks so cool! The Snow Trooper is so amazing! And this are the changes that are coming in the game. I have another one that I'm gonna show you right now. Hold on tight, fellas. This is a good one. Town Towns. <laughs> Town Towns, fellas. Yes. As you guys know, um, it is difficult to believe that you can have breachers like the Bonta in hot because it's too cold and you know it's all snowy. So you're gonna be able to replace units like, for example, the Banta with the Town Towns. <laughs> that is such a cool detail and that is exactly what the community was expecting and I'm super super happy to be able to deliver you all this amazing news that are happening in Star Wars Command. I'm not really sure when this is gonna happen but it's in the making. It's gonna happen and hopefully hopefully super super soon. Rogue One, a Star Wars story so excited about this movie i'm not gonna give you any details i try not to read that much because i really don't want to spoil my uh my impression of watching this movie rock one i'm super super excited i cannot wait to see darth vader again i'm not really sure if he's good or bad that is something that we're gonna figure out together in a few more months but why this is important because star Wars command is also gonna try to implement and bring some uh I don't know if characters, but maybe skins, or maybe troops, or maybe mercenaries from Rogue One. Ah ha ha! Those are things that we're gonna figure out together, fellas, because I don't have details about that, but they're definitely gonna add some factions, some, some details from Rogue One. A Star Wars story. Fellas, this is the Game Hunter. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Star Wars Commander, I'm super excited. I cannot way to start playing more and more and more and cannot wait to see all these changes so let's get ready and i will see you in the next one tech empire <laughs>